She will run around my legs trying to climb me. She wants my attention at every single second. <laughs> she is like having a toddler. <laughs> Hazel is definitely mischievous. You're a little troublemaker. <laughs> she loves to get into everything. <laughs> I'm just trying to empty the laundry. It's not helpful if you burrow in there. She is aware that I don't always want her to get into things and she doesn't care. What are you doing? Would you just like to help yourself out to the dog food? Really, friend? On the table again. Rolly. <laughs> she just <laughs> always wants to be involved and be as destructive as possible while doing it in the sweetest way. I did not turn this off. And my beautiful plant. So I'm a licensed class two wildlife rehabilitator and Hazel arrived to me last May as a little baby. She actually had pneumonia and she got better and she had a little buddy and they were going to be released together. Somebody is impatiently waiting for breakfast. And then right before release, we realized her teeth seemed too long. <laughs> my beautiful little friend. You need a teeth trim. And so this is actually common when an animal does get pneumonia at a really young age. So Hazel requires teeth trimming every three weeks for the rest of her life. Once I heard she wasn't releasable, I decided to keep her. I adored her and she's just such a happy being. Loves the other animals in the house as well. Her and my dog love to play together. <laughs> Seeing how Hazel has become friends with everyone brings a tear up to my eye. If someone told me years ago that I'd have a groundhog living with me, I definitely would not have believed them. And it's just, now that she's here with us, I can't even imagine what life would be without her. She just makes every day more fun and she brightens every single day. <laughs> hey, my little munchkin doodle. <laughs> 